Hello, everybody. Let us pray. The map to victory. Ever find yourself thinking like this? I know God has a plan for me. I'm just not sure what I'm supposed to do or which direction to take to see his purpose fulfilled in my life. God wants us to do things his way, not our way, for our own good. Ephesians 32-8 says, I will instruct and teach thee in the way which thou shalt go. I will guide thee with mine eyes. He knows what's best and will not steer you down the path that leads to failure and destruction. Are you willing to let his promise slip through your fingers because you're so determined to do it your way? Or will you let him lead and guide you to receive the prosperity and victory he has for you? Learn to receive God's best in every area of your life. The victory is yours. Happy Friday, y'all. This was yesterday's prayer. All right, so God's telling me that the Internet is our new 40 acres in the mule. See, we've got to connect our social media, see, to our cell phones and to our laptops. We're starting a new day, and we need to give God thanks that we have a new day and that we are able to have a little meal here. I'm inviting you all to have a little bowl of oatmeal with me this morning. I, I love oatmeal. I love a little bit of oatmeal with my butter, as you can see. And this is this is the power of the pen moment. That's what that all that is, see. If somebody would have told me years ago that one day I would take a, a marker and I would do something to really impact the world, I wouldn't have ever believed it. But that's just how good God's been to me. And he's letting me use the power of the pen to give you the pay raise challenge and to uh, give you some instructions on how to change your daily life. God has given me the opportunity to share with you and to remove your blindness for those who are blinded over those who think they have eyes but they cannot see, according to Robert Kiyosaki. Robert Kiyosaki is the author of the book, Rich Dad, Poor Dad. I'm Kevin Weathers. I'm the CEO in Messiah Pay Raise. I am not the deliverer to Jews. I always like to say that. But I am. Definition number two. This is the power of the pen moment. So, right here. Definition number two. I am a great leader. That's the definition. That's the second definition of Messiah. For those who don't know that. Google it. Check it out. All right. I'm a great leader of an organization called Pay Raise Money Factory. Okay. We're getting fired up here today. I had damaged my computer here unknowingly by grasping and touching right on the screen. I actually touched over here, but now there's two of them. It's a duplication process. I told y'all. All right. So let's get this one here off the ground a little bit here. I can still see it look quite a bit. I still make do on it, but I got another one over here that uh, it's my little backup system. You got to have a backup system, y'all. Now, it ain't perfect, but it does do the job, okay? That's that's what's important. It's a Dell system, you see? Y'all remember this old Dell system? I had, see, I got had a little something in the closet, little, little, got a little kickstand, a little extra, a little extra something going on there. There we go. Got to get it going now. Got to pump the brakes on that one. But it's still Windows XP and it's still working. Just as powerful today as it was then. So let's go over this right here. All right. First of all, I want to give you the pay raise challenge. This is your wealth test. If you have never had one, guess what? That's because the rich don't want you to be wealthy. They control everything. See? 
only one per 100 people are even getting rich. And that's usually the 1%. So, that's what this is all about right here. Take the pay raise challenge. Look for yourself. Put your own eyeballs in it. And uh, let me sign in on this computer here. All right, let's make some noise. All right, so the pay raise challenge is to go to the video on YouTube, How to Turn Your Yearly Income into Your Monthly Income by Bob Proctor. About middle ways through that video, Bob Proctor is going to talk about you can go to Howard or Oxford, and they don't teach us how to earn money. What they do is they teach you how to count it, move it around, and tell you you can invest it, but they don't tell you how to earn money. So uh, about halfway through that video of Bob Proctor's, it's a 15-minute video, he's going to start talking about there's only three legal ways to earn money. You have M1, M2, and M3. M1 being the 96% of people who trade time for money on a job. I don't have that. Well, I might have the diagram in, in some of these. Uh, I'm going to let you visualize it. That way you get it, you get it right firsthand in your brain, okay? M1 being... Uh, the 96% of the people, I got a little diagram right here, I'll let you see it. M1 being the 96% of the people, this big piece of the pie right there, who trade time for money on a job. You can't get wealthy that way. You can't even put the kids through, through school. So you see, you can't get wealthy that way. Uh-oh, what have we got here? Got a message on the side of there. I'm going to make sure my camera ain't sideways. And then 3% being people who try to take some of that money that they've worked for and invest it in stock market. I say 87% of them lose their money with all the hackers and, and uh, see what's going on here with my computer. Yeah, okay, there we go. With all the hackers and scammers out there. That's right. Wake up, baby. Wake up. All right. And then the 1% is the, is the rich people. Only one out of 100 people are doing the right thing. The other 99 people will tell that one person that what they're doing won't work. Imagine that. Hmm. See, we've been taught that the majority rules. So if 96% and 3% is 99%, isn't that the majority of 100%? My question to you is why isn't this, this majority rich then? Hmm. Well, you know what? We've been tricked. Like I said, the irony is that the 99% of of the people who are set up to fail, they will tell the one percenters what they are doing will not work. Okay, I want to get I want to get on back over here to this uh, blind eye thing right quick before I run out of space. All right, so here's what we got here. Behold, balance. You always got to have a God spiritually, mentally, physically, and emotionally. In the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. Pay raise is a vision map and service. This is what I'm trying to show y'all. There's a there's millions of people across the globe who have eyes, but you can't see money because your third eye. It's a lack of vision. Your third eye is closed. And that's why you don't see this M1, M2, and M3 thing. And a lot of people are following this guy around or this woman. It could be either or. But only one out of 100 people are getting prosperous because they're, they're not blind. And they, they know that their third eye is open and they can look at you and tell whether you're spending your money on assets or liabilities. Assets puts money in your pocket. Liabilities takes it out. An expense can either be an asset or a liability. That's basic financial literacy. So we're going to teach teachers to teach basic financial literacy and understanding. You know, this is the person leading you, possibly. So we've got to change that. How many people across the, go, uh, across the, the globe that's supposed to be Huh. A little power of the pen moment there. And let's get the right color real quick before I run out of time. Okay. And we're boiling down to running out of time. But I'll fix that. But anyway, this is what we're talking about here, okay? I'm Kevin Weathers. I'm the CEO of Pay Raise. 